I was running into the same problem as yesterday where I started streaming and I didn't get disconnected as far as OBS was concerned, but uh, Twitch was not showing me online. I'm not sure why that is. Now I'm dropping frames, and I wasn't oh, dropping frames before. We are never getting out of here. Look out! Ah, I need to Hurry! check very quickly whether or not I can see lost. myself live. No Hi, Quilix. So you're you are seeing the stream? Then I don't have to ask myself whether or not. Yeah, I wasn't dropping frames when I was streaming in the void, and now that I, that, that I am live on Twitch, it's uh, forcing me to drop frames, but whatever. Yeah, I was streaming, I had started playing the game and everything, but it marked me live, and then it forced me offline or something, and now my internet is all over the place. Go figure. Uh, it was fine when I was uh, not live. But there's us four. We've done okay so far. Anyway, okay. Well, so I'm gonna start over then. This is Spooktober, day 16th, and this is Dead Space Extraction on the Wii, and this is part one of probably two. I'm still dropping frames. Ah, oh, well, it's not as bad as it was the other day. I'm just gonna have to roll with it. No, don't, don't don't do that. It's gonna interrupt me when I play if the batteries are weak. Uh, okay, can't even change the batteries without the game pausing. Ah, uh, boy, there's always something. Internet, batteries, Twitch itself. There's always something. Yeah, yeah, resume the game. There we go. That's better. No, yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry, Lexine, I was indeed. next to the recharging station. Are you calling about tonight? No, because then it wouldn't be a surprise. I'll recharge those later. I'm mad at you, Sam Caldwell. Why? Because you somehow forgot to tell me what you're doing today. It's just a routine excavation. Stream of life never gives you a break. You're yeah, extracting indeed. a marker. My supervisor Leon's nuts with excitement. Did you know he's a unitologist? This is a big deal. Leon's always been nuts. Anyway, we don't know if it's a marker or just a big rock. That's why we're doing this, so the boffins can study it. Sam Caldwell. If you had an imagination, you'd be dangerous. We'll see about that tonight. Ooh, I look forward to it. Gotta go, honey. I love you. I love you too. Later. It's a weird thing that's happening with my connection. It, it's stable, oh, and on. then every at the same intervals of time, uh, of time, <laughs> it, it will be dro when dropping a few frames. She'd kill me if I bailed on her. Well, everyone else it's is almost perfectly by. regular. All we're waiting for is you, so don't expect me to make excuses if we're still working tonight. Let's get this done. Yeah, you can 
wrap things with a telekinesis or something. Sam, is your helmet secure? Sterling, this is Cooper. We're That's already out of sight. Where the hell are you guys? Yeah, we're on our way, boss. Be there in a minute. You seen that vidlog of the marker that's going around? Looks just like the one back on Earth. Just like the one Unitologist claimed ammo. is back on Earth, you mean. And there's one big difference. Earth is Earth. Whereas this beautiful place we call Aegis 7 is nothing but a ball of space rock. I mean, come on, what are the odds? And there it is. Bigger than I imagined. About time. Give Banks a hand fixing up the track and loader. All three of us? Damn straight. If this thing gets so much to scratch, Chief Barrow will have us all scrubbing air vents. Hey Banks, what do you need? The wind's blown out some of the track we laid. Rivet it back into place and get it tight. Come on. That thing's gotta be man-made. Hurry up! Cooper's already pissed off. The game off itself the is dropping frames because Copy that. Uh, I'm right behind you, Sterling. The frame rate is completely uncapped in this game. And then the stream is dropping some frames too. Speed to fire. Guess all that target practice paid off, huh? Good job. Now can the loader's without... arms in position. One of you TK it, the ah, other yes, two rivet the joints. Egan, I'll take these two. And watch your aim. I don't want to end up on crutches like Matthews. Get this thing on board. Didn't get to copy the raid command somehow. Lexine's right. Leon would Thank you guys. Welcome this. everyone. Hopefully my internet holds this time. Uh, Steady your hand there, like the other day. I got it. Almost there. Not doing too hot right now, but looking good. Counter balance is stable, gyros online. Ready for load. Stand by. I'm starting a five down. Five, four, three, two, one, mark. You, what's happening? Just happened. The ears are ringing. Shit! Whatever it was, it broke the Egan, get over there and stabilize it before we have a miniature black hole in our hands. Me, Banks, and Bear will get the marker inside. 16. Which one's that? The closest one, you idiot. Head down Mega Vent 24. You can't miss it. It's a little mushy here now. <laughs> what the hell was that? Come on, guys, we gotta get a move on. Sterling to Central, I'm outside. Can you tell me what that bang was? Shit, the flash must have knocked out comms too. Activate, though I don't know what I'm supposed to activate. It's all T3 here now. <laughs> Plus to adjust options and new tips. Uh, 
can't see a thing without the lights. There should be a box of glowworms in the airlock storage chamber. We could use them. Good Icky Mush. Hopefully, I, my internet doesn't go out right. before you go and come back. Worm. Shake the remote to charge the glowworm. Ah, like that? Look around. We should grab some supplies before we head down. Personal log, Dr. Kain T, Chief Science Officer Ishimura. The artifact from the colony does indeed appear to be a genuine marker, the first to be found in Unitology's 200-year history. I'm eager to get it on board the ship so I can study it properly. Oh yeah, I need to recharge it then. Engaged. We should be fine now. Shit. Sounds like someone's in trouble. No, Hold you think? On. Wait a second. We don't know what's going on in there. Or maybe it's just someone who stubbed his toe or something. <laughs> what the fuck? What in God's name are you doing? Get off him! Pachenko, stop! I'll... I'll shoot you! You know these rivet guns pack a punch. I could... I couldn't shoot it myself. Shit! Help me! He's out of his mind! Sterling! Oh! Oh, uh, that was gross. Yeah, it blew its head off, yeah. Oh man, I can't, I can't believe this. Sam, get that rock saw. We may need it. That thing? Rock saw. Jesus Christ, we just killed some. We don't have time to think about that. If we don't fix that tether fast, we'll all be dead. Move! Look out! More of them! We've all gone fucking crazy! <laughs> Part of the problem with these games is the camera shake. That's not always easy to, to aim with the camera shaking so much. I only briefly started okay, playing guys, the go. original Dead Space once on the a few PC. Levels down. Up ahead. You guys see that? It's blocked. Looks like they had problems down here before. This is a bad idea. We shouldn't have come this way. From Bo Edward Sam, M. Calm okay, down. guys. Cut that security line. Use that Everyone is talking at the same time in this game. You better pick up the pace. I want the tether back up pronto. Okay, can I read now? Thank you. Okay, guys, this isn't funny anymore. All mega event lockers in Sector B belong to Team B. Not Team A, not Team C. B! As in, you guys are bastards for breaking in and stealing our shit. How would you like to pull a 12-hour shift in total darkness because someone stole your glowworm, huh? Glowworm, huh? Where the hell are all the damn rivet bolts? I swear to Altman, the next guy I see poking around Team B's lockers is gonna get a boot up his ass. First thought you didn't have fun anymore. <laughs> uh, 
shake and uncheck for a melee strike. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, yeah, I did it accidentally earlier. Coming through. I swear, I first I played this game when it came out and never played it since. Lexi. I've forgotten how it controls. They must have put this here to stop people coming up. Can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> supposed to go then there it is over there it's coming man oh good it's calling oh, quiet. us quiet you hear that they're coming there's no way to hide god help us all he's trapped in there is there anybody left? i'll check it out and meet you in the gravity tether room go it's death sam can't you see it it needs our help Egan, what the hell are you talking about? You're losing our minds, one after the other. But Zachenko, we killed him. I know, but you saw what happened in there. It's, it's like it wasn't really him. We should take that plasma cutter too. Listen to us. This is all wrong. Plasma cutter is a pre precision slicer designed to cut small quantities of excava excavated minerals and ore. You have primary fire, it fires a horizontal beam of energy, and then if you tilt the Wii remote sideways, then it fires a vertical beam of energy. This is used to slice off the limbs of your enemies, just like in the base, Dead Space game. No difference. Come on, Egan. I don't want to waste any more time down here. Let's just do this and get out of here. Look out! There's more! Shit! Ah. Get behind me! You don't understand. It's not right! We have to end it! Oh. Hey! Oh, Egan, stop it. What are you doing? Dude! You can't stop it. You can't fight it. Ah! <laughs> don't, don't make me shoot you. Egan, please! Oh, God, Egan. I'm Egan sorry. leave me a choice. This is Cooper. I can't reach Sterling or Egan. How are you guys doing? Something bad's happened. Egan, he went crazy and everyone down here, they're trying to kill us. Egan's gone. You're breaking up. I can barely hear you. Just get on that tether before it starts a feedback loop and takes everything down with it. What's going on? Off. 
Are you okay? Come on! Don't make it's me do one this. Of them. I'm trying to save you. Okay, this is a time where you can look around. I didn't understand at first. <laughs> Jesus, hold it together. Damn it. Central to Coldwell. Stasis modules are standard equipment for all Mega Vent personnel. I know you haven't been trained in it, but if you find one, it could come in handy. What was that? What was that? Gotta go on a train now, can't bring my laptop, so I will say bye for now. Okie dokie, uh, Qualix. Perfect. Have a safe trip. Okay. Just Take care, friend. Stasis in at the right moment. Press to slow down moving objects. Copy that. Coldwell out. Get out of my head! I might be running out of ammo for that one. Okay, yeah, so there's these three things around the reticle. Top left, top right, and at the bottom. I guess when they're blue, it means that I have a charge that allows me to slow down an enemy so I can better... I, I can take a better shot at them. Yeah, like right now, it's reloaded. Sam? Are you okay? Lexine! Lexine. God, it's good to hear you. Things are pretty bad right now. No. I mean, did you hear? Some unitologists just killed themselves in Union Square. There are pictures. It's horrible. Leon was there. People are flipping out all over the colony. We've been attacked and Egan went crazy. I killed him, Lex. You... Sam? Say that again. I killed Egan. I had no choice. He tried to kill me. I'm scared. Somebody just told me some sectors are losing oxygen, too. Hold on. That could be from the blast. The life support power room isn't far from here. You think that's what's wrong with the, the oxygen? Colony. Just hold tight, baby. I'll fix it, I promise. I know! Stay away from me! Planetary Mining, the Earth is Future by Fatou, Fatou S. Reif, Reif. Planet mining is quite literally the dismantling of planets and moons on a micro scale. Entire worlds are fractured to reveal the rich seams of valuable minerals contained inside. Despite environmentalist concerns, the operation is perfectly safe and is the only way to extract the necessary resources on the large scale required to supply Earth and the colonies. Funny thing, actually, I was watching a video the other day about mining asteroids for uh, certain types of metals that are rare on Earth, so that we would stop harming the environment on Earth. I was just watching something about, about that like two days ago. You may have read reports that claim the, the destruction of a planet can destroy an, ent an entire solar system due to the disruption in the gravitation forces that hold each celestial object in orbit. Concerned investors are directed directed to read the article The CC Pledge to the, uh, to the Health of Our Universe for a detailed breakdown of the truth about planet cranking. Oh. 
I wonder if that upgrades. Ah, oh, yeah. Apparently, the capacity of my weapon has life support increased. is through here. But warning, no gravity. Is that was that what it said? Now entering zero gravity. Oh, okay. Warning: Colony life support systems offline. There it is. Hope the antigrav still works. There. Almost got it. Baby, don't worry. Can't seem to focus. Why'd you kill me? I'm not a monster. Sam! Sam, what's the matter? Nothing. It's all right. Just stay out of sight, okay? Be careful. I love you. I love you. Oh. The heck? What the hell? It takes you by surprise. We have to stop it. Is this even real? Oh, I'm abusing the freeze not real. thing, but... They don't seem to be zombies, at least. Yeah. You're not. Hostile is down. Hostile. Hostile is down. Good shot, sir. Shooting one of your own is never good. He's not even packing a gun. You're shitting me. This is the guy that slaughtered his entire crew. Why'd you do it, son? All these people never did uh -huh. anything. Uh-huh, hello. Lex. He's gone. Call Commander James and get Doc Skirella down here. He's gonna have a busy day. Sam. I died? I like... No, no, this is the end of the chapter, more like. Yeah, I think. I hope. <laughs> uh, audio logs. Ah, I missed one. Ah, well. It's alright. Just playing casually. <laughs> Uh, congratulations, new feature and unlocked. Uh, chapter 2 story mode, plasma cutter level 1, rivet gun level 1, rig upgrades 1 plus 50 HP. Oh, shit, I was supposed to press continue. Sorry. Uh, 
continue. Days after the extraction incident, Detective Nathan McNeil is overwhelmed with homicide reports when a familiar face comes to visit. So if the guy I was playing is dead, am I playing someone else now? The Schofield tool... Schofield tools, rivet gun is a precision multi-tool, yeah, blah blah blah. P-sec pistol... Okay, yeah. Let's go, I suppose. I never tried this game in co-op, actually. Sub called well diseased, yeah. That's what it says. Ah, yeah, maybe now I'm playing that guy. Yeah, yeah, him, Nathan McNeil. Shit. Detective Nathan McNeil. Well, I'll be damned. Gabe Weller. Oh, when I, I requested him. help from the Ishimura, I didn't realize they had you on board. Transferred six months ago. It's been a long time, Nate. It's good to see you. No, it's been hell down here. Some extra hands will come in useful. Sorry, no cop duty. We have an errand. An errand? Gabe, we've got assaults, murder, suicides, almost 60 dead and dozens injured. Nobody here's ever seen anything like it. We just can't cope. Cope? Wasn't it you who pulled me out of a three-way firefight on Scorpio 6 and then went back in to plant limpets? And now some crazy miners have got you losing sleep? It's not that simple. So what is this errand anyway? Baines! Hutchins! Hey. You too, rookie. We need to get to the morgue. Think you can cope with giving us direction? I'll take you. I have to drop this off at evidence anyhow. What do you want with the morgue? The captain sent us to retrieve the bodies from the Union Square suicide before they pop the cork on the planet. But keep it quiet, okay? Oh, sure. Your crew's really inconspicuous. You gonna introduce us? Baines and Hutchins, two of my best. Detective. Baines. A pleasure. And Carkins here is my rookie. It's an honor, sir. Sergeant Weller speaks highly of you. You got the face <laughs> of someone who's going to die don't soon. Let him fill your head I don't know why. Your tail, son. Baines, Hutchins, go prep the shuttle and wait for us. Yes, sir. His face reminds me of an actor, actually, but right. I can't quite Follow put me. it. Not super famous or anything, but I've, I've seen a face very similar to his somewhere else. Oh, wait. Am I free to look around? Oh. Medical lock, Dr. Warwick B. Chief Psych Officer. Harris is asleep after another strong sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after 50 plus hours of waking, regardless of any desire to stay awake. Not Harris. His explanation of events here on Aegis 7 is also odd and points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere on the colony. His guilt is not in doubt. Two planet side security officers were pre present when. He took Dr. Ciarillo hostage and murdered Nurse Evans. And he doesn't deny his actions, but he insists there was no crime, nor does he feel guilt. I'm doing this. I'm, I'm searching the environment for so anything. So you're the rookie, huh? Must be why you got the shitty transport job. Actually, I'm here because Sergeant Weller doesn't want to handle corpses. I guess some things never change. Lop it up, partner. McCabe to McNeil. Nate, you there? McNeil here. What's up? Multiple assault in the mess hall in your sector. Sounds like a riot down there. Are you up? Not right now. Higgins should be good for it, though. All right, thanks. McCabe out. I told you things were crazy down here. You sure this is the right mall? We only have one. <laughs> I was here just yesterday. It was a full house. Not anymore. I'll need to see a manifest. Captain won't like this. Sir, there's a Body toe tag here. here. Abbott, D. Ring any bells, McNeil? 
That's the crazy son of a bitch who led the mass suicide. Hold on, I'll pull him up. He's on file, but there's no record of a transfer. He should be right here. You? What are you doing here? Get out! Doc, you all right? Holy shit, he's lost it! Help! No! I got your back! He's down. What do you reckon? He stashed the body somewhere? Maybe. Let's go check. The hell? Is that normal? Not really, no. Hold on, I've got a glowworm. Twelve bullets. Uh, ah, no, okay, no, twelve in the charger Shit. out of ninety-six. Whatever it was must have knocked out the elevator, too. Great. No lights, no elevators, no bodies. And a colony full of crazy people. Sir, what's going on? Keep it together, Private. Sergeant Weller to Ishimura. Come in, Ishimura. Damn it! We can get up through the medical hall instead. Let's go. That look in his eyes reminded me of a kid that went crazy last week. Just an engineer, but something in him snapped. You mean like these guys? Yeah, kind of. Okay. I don't get it. This is the same shit that's been happening all over the colony. It's like it's spreading. The riot? It's calling to us. To death and and beyond. This guy is losing what it did you too. Say? Uh sorry. Nothing, sir. This is the only way through. Be ready for anything, Kirklands. Shut up! I'm trying to think! PSEC, what's going on here? Stay out of this cop! It's none of your business! Just tell me what the problem is, son. You don't want to hurt anyone, do you? No. No, you, you're trying to trick me. I can feel my head's gonna burst. I'll get one of the docs to look at it, okay? Just walk to me. Yeah, nice and easy. That's better. Now take it easy. Drop the gun. No! Get out of my head! Uh, don't take another step. I warned you! It's too late to say I warned you after you've already popped his head. Jesus. I warned you! Well, you <laughs> go ahead to PSEC. Head through the lobby and then turn off the plaza. I'll stay here and deal with these guys. Do you want me to stay and help, sir? No. Come on, rookie. See you back at your office, McNeil. Shit! Not you two! Back off! All of you! Shit. I have to warn Weller and Carklands. Situation report. Sergeant Sizzle J, Precinct 12. Responding to civic responded to civic disturbance call in Union Square. HQ advised of, of numerous reports of harassment, weapon possession, vandalism, reported to scene with Officer Shea. No disturbance in progress. Call in new sit rep to HQ. Multiple possible homicides and or suicides. Mass suicide suspected. Most victims exhibited signs of blunt force trauma or jugular evisceration. Several victims had apparent gunshot wounds. Trace residue of colony blue observed on one victim's mouth and nose. Although narcotics are not suspected as a motive at this time. <laughs> Hey, 
If anyone's out there, come out. Identify yourself. Ah, crap. Why is the camera acting like this? I warned you. Okay, it's just his catchphrase, I suppose. I warned you. Don't take another step. anymore science log from dr. kind T, chief science officer to the attention of captain Matthias B further to our previous conversation I asked that you delay bringing the marker up from the planet for a day or two you know I am as keen as anyone to study it in detail and I understand your sense of urgency given the events on the colony, but that's why I ask. What's happening down there is just too unique, too unprecedented to cut it short without proper time to study the causes and effects. In light of a discussion I had with Dr. Mercer, I'd like to meet with doc doctors Ciarello and Welland planet side to get the observations. Terrence. That, that's why. To the right. Look to the right. There was a noise. Whoa, hey, Panda. And okay, this guy just slit his own throat. Jesus. The whole colony's gone to hell. Problem. <laughs> just go. Hell, it just doesn't stop. <laughs> Some of them take more shots, it seems. Was it like this when he got here? Worse. That's a fight our way through. What's he doing, the other, the other guy there? Sounds like your rookie's losing it. Yeah. 
Reckon whatever's gone to everyone else down here oh, is getting to him too. Why is it that it's not Shouldn't affecting it everyone? Out. If he cracks, I'll deal with it. The day I can't put down a rookie is the day I hang up my boots. Uh, <laughs> the heck? Dude! Wait. I did say so that he was gonna be the first one to die. It's not because I remembered, it's just his face. He, he had that look. Your rookie lost his oh, mind the guy that dies first. Sucker punch. Can't believe Cutlins did that. Neither of us is getting any younger. Shit! Where did these guys come from? What the hell with this? Get inside p -Sec. We can barricade ourselves in. Sounds like a damn good idea to me. Ah, okay. I can't hold this door forever, McNeil. They're still coming. Hurry up. Yeah, but I didn't understand what I was supposed to do at first. Can't you go any faster? Okay. It's done. They won't get through that. Then let's get to your office so I can call the Ishimura. See if Chief Vincent's got the answers. Gunfire. Where's it coming from? Upstairs, I think. Shit. Maybe some Over that racket, you can hear that there's gunshots well, we coming from upstairs. In. Whatever it is, it's our problem now. This is Jones. Open call to all PSEC officers. Listen up. Body shots don't put these things down. Aim for the limbs, take out the joints to immobilize them. What things? What's he talking about? Don't know. He can't mean the colonists. Is there something else in here? Either that. Or he's flipped like everyone else around here. Plasma cutter would be Jeez. better to cut off their limbs, these guys. So aliens do exist. And they're trying to kill us. Isn't life dandy? Oh wait, isn't that where I was before? So maybe I already searched these things actually. Oh, this is Lexine. Thanks for the help. Who the hell are you? Easy, Weller. She's not p -Sec. I'm McNeil. What's your name? Lexine. Lexine Murdoch. Well, Lexine, you're a lucky girl. Lucky? My boyfriend was killed last week. My father's gone missing, and now this? Wait a second. I recognize you. You're Sam Caldwell's emergency contact. 
Sam was my boyfriend. Listen, I'm sorry about what happened. What are you doing here? My father's missing. He disappeared at the same time all those unitologists killed themselves. I came to see if there was any news, but then those... things came in and started killing everyone. What's happening? I'm not sure. But it's not good for anyone. You think? Ishimura! The colony is under attack from unknown hostiles! Come in, goddammit! Orbital comms must have gone down with the rest of the electrics. We're on our own. Wait. You're from the ship? Yes. Special Security Task Force. Then why don't we just go there? You must have a shuttle, right? She's right. Baines and Hutch are waiting to tell for you. Us. Come on, McNeil. Wait. What about me? Go home, lock yourself up, and sit tight. Home? Are you crazy? I've lost everyone. Sorry, sweetheart, but you can't you know, come with us. You know, pretty decimated. We can't handle another missing persons case. What are you talking about? Which is why you should come with us. Right, Sergeant? She's your responsibility. Fine. Let's go. Are you from the ship too? No. I'm a PSEC detective. Nate McNeil. Well, thank you, Nate McNeil. Just doing my job. He was there when your boyfriend was either a shot or a... But I'm not sure, actually. They say he's dead. Or maybe he did die from what they did to him. I'm not sure, but... Plate that we s welded to the to the door there it just popped into view actually it was not loaded um. branching path actually I think if you can't figure out what you're supposed to do fast enough then uh, you, you get rerouted to a, the, a different path through the level holy shit oh my god no way they did this to each other they probably thought they'd be safe inside peace and we kept them out they were trying to kill us remember that Kind of quiet all of a sudden. I feel like I'm being watched. Because we probably are. Keep it tight. That noise. Yeah. yeah. You see that? What the hell is it doing? See? Shit! Look out! No! Making more of the same. Yeah, I know they're coming out of the bodies or something, no? Are we just gonna stand there and wait for all of them to turn? Shouldn't we leave? Well, this one isn't making more of the same. 
Oh God. They're not aliens. They're people. They're people. Were people. Whatever they are now, it isn't human. Let's just get to the shuttle. Mission Square. Let's go. What do you make of that? Somebody was trying to keep the bad guys out. We'll have to clear it. Incoming! Keep going! I'll hold them off! Yeah, sure. Shake it. We don't need to rebuild the barricade. And I thought I was the optimist here. Mission Square's right up ahead. We should keep moving. I remember this area. The shuttle base just off the square, right? That's right. Good. Baines, Hutchins, give me a sit rep. In the shuttle and standing by, Sarge. It's bloody chaos down here, though. I had to break a few noses to stop people piling in oh, with us. Yeah, Baines. Everyone's looking for a way out. Look! There's one taking off now! There's a sight for sore eyes. Wait. Something's wrong. Uh... She's gonna crash! Get down! <laughs> this is the kind of thing that I see in my nightmares. <laughs> Something crashing down. Oh no! Look at them! All those people! Dead! Every shuttle in the bay, destroyed. Damn it! Baines and Hutchins were in there! God damn this fucking place! Uh, uh, there's something there, something there! Upgrade for the plasma cutter. Lucky man. What's your name? <coughs> Warren... <coughs> Warren Eckhart. Executive Director of Colonial Mining Operations. Quite a mouthful. You're lucky to even be alive after that. The shuttles! They're all gone. We're stuck here. Not necessarily. There's a surveying shuttle in the Sector 8 maintenance bay. Are you sure? Quite sure. I hitched a ride on it yesterday from the Ishimura. You're from the ship? What are you doing here? CEC business. And none of yours, Sergeant. Who cares? Let's yeah. just find the shuttle and go. <laughs> For all we know, those you things will all across the colony. Are you ready to fight your way through them? We may not have to. Megavent 12 runs underneath the colony, and I'm sure there's an exit into the maintenance bay. So how do we get into this... Megavent? There's an equipment lift ahead. It should take us straight down. Then what are we waiting for? We can't get in! Damn! McNeil, clear that debris!
Go! Get in! With pleasure. What's wrong? Why is it stopped? The power's down. There must be a broken connection. I'll fix it. Why is it always me? Are you in? All right, going down. Ooh. Let's see. Damage taken, 110%. Uh, weapons, collectibles. Uh, there were two weapons that I did not get, I suppose. Weapon upgrades, I got three. Okay then. Uh, stasis upgrade one, chapter three, stage one challenge mode, bonus comic number two. Uh, continue. Adjust how much the camera shakes and the screen's brightness in the visual settings menu. I'd like that. Maybe don't turn it off completely, but uh, also don't let it shake too much. So, is it safe now? Shh. There's a service hatch down there. We can seal it to keep them out. Hold it right there. Don't shoot! I'm on your side! I'm just hiding from those things! Not for long. They're on our tail. What? Then keep it down! They'll hear us! Wait, you mean they're down here? Blindly, but it's not easy. We have to keep them out. Grab that sheet and plug it over the hatch. Move. Now hold it steady while I fix it into place. Use your rivet gun. We won't hold like this, McNeil. Rivet another bolt in there. Log, Denver's Q in V24, a response to organic growth in Megavans. The unidentified growth seen in other parts of the colony has now reached the Megavans. I don't know what the hell is this stuff is. Looks like someone threw up their guts all over the walls, but it's spreading faster than we can cut it up, which is pretty disgusting in itself. It's already in the ventilation spoke, and if we can't find a way to stop it soon, it'll hit the filtration chamber by the day after tomorrow. I hope the boffins are looking into it because it's way beyond me. What the hell is this stuff? It smells like vomit. How long has it been like this? We found a little last week. We didn't think much of it. Today, this. Get down! Look, up there. Yeah, I see it too. Sarge, this is Baines. How is he alive? Baines! Jesus, I thought I'd lost you. 
If we hadn't been inside the shuttle, we'd be toast. It's a wreck, though. We won't be flying anywhere in it. Where are you? We're in a megabed, heading to the Sector 8 maintenance bay. There's a shuttle we can use. But we sealed off the entrance here. Can you find another route? We'll do our best, Sarge. See you there. Happened here? I don't know. Man, that's a lot of bodies. But none of them are human. Wait, what's this? This is Amanda Castle, a surveyor of Aegis 7. I'm concerned about the dementia people here are suffering. After we brought the artifact inside, the marker, as the unitologists call it, the extraction team all went crazy. The brass says it's coincidence, but that's bullshit! Now, half the miners are suffering from some weird dementia, but nobody dares suggest it's because of the artifact. Well, I will, and I don't like where this is going. Dementia? Interesting. Why? We've all seen what she was talking about. Indeed. So why aren't we going crazy too? He's right. None of us have been affected. I guess. Unless I'm crazy and uh, you're all figments of my imagination. You don't have that much imagination, Weller. Can we hurry up and find the shuttle? We can all play shrink once we're in orbit. He's right. No use standing around here. Move out. that carefully <laughs> what was I that like kind of answer it's a freight truck for moving equipment I'm getting the same I just saw one of the flying creatures the same there. vibe as when Get I was first playing this of watching an interactive movie or something boxes but I can't open them. Luxine, you okay? You've been quiet ever since you found that audio log. Yeah, I'm fine. Just just thinking about my dad. He worked here in the vents. Hey, it's a little early for the past tense. He could be on one of the shuttles that already left. We'll look for him when we get to the ship. Everyone's looking for someone. What was that? Yeah, nothing. You're just mumbling. Ignore me. It's kind of hard to do. Well, that's what I wanted to do. This one is closed. Where do we go? Down there. Obviously, I can't recall what I did 10 years ago, so I can't remember if I ever went the other way, but I feel like old me would have gone through the the flat path instead of going further down. They run 24 hours. Officer Hutchins to Sergeant Weller. Come in, sir. Weller here. 
Watch your 20, Hutchins. We're in the hub corridors. There's some kind of foreign substance all over. It's like, like meat growing She's out of the world. got a Slavic accent, and yet her name doesn't here, suggest any it seems to be in her. You getting any trouble up there? Negative, sir. We've hardly encountered anything. I think we're being watched, but that's all. Let's hope it stays that way. Well, I'm out. <laughs> Once I got its head, that it would not be alive anymore. So I was wrong. Pulse rifle. The pulse rifle is military grade assault rifle designed for defending CEC ships from pirates. Primary fire, an automatic fire mode that shoots rounds at a high rate. Ultra or alternate fire type. A charged fire mode that shoots 10 rounds simultaneously. There's no point in fighting those things if we're just going to fight amongst ourselves, too. Two egos too big to fit. One of them will have to go. Shh, listen. Oh, God. How are we supposed to stay safe if those things can fly? Stay between me and Mary. We'll protect you.
going stop, there, but... Dead. Oh, it's hell. Ah, crap, there was something else, too, but... Oh, come on, give me another chance. I think there was a weapon there. Ah, missed it. For this. You're doing fine, soldier. I've got your back. Damn it. This place is a wreck. Now what? We can't go back. What about the air vents? They go all over the colony. Are you mad? The aliens would be in the vents too. And so Sarge, far it has been in there well, very again. often. Watch your 20. Pretty close to the maintenance bay, but things are getting serious. There's a gang of hostiles up ahead, and no alternate route. We'll have to go through them. Be careful. I want to see you both alive when we get there. No worries, Satch. Bane's out. All right, that settles it. How do we get into the air vents? There's an access panel over there, but I don't know if I have enough clearance to unlock it. The hell with clearance. I'll get it. Field Tools Frame Thrower is an industrial torch suitable for melting small deposits of ore. Shoots a steady stream of hydrazine flame fuel, an alternate fire mode. Shoots a viscous ball of fire that sticks to targets. Okay. I'm done. I thought you didn't want to go through the vents. Go, go, get I don't in there. Want to be out here at feeding time either. This is reminding me of that alien isolation right now. Going in the vents like that. as fast as I can. Ah, yeah, they're playing through the Wii Remote. Quiet. Listen. Oh, no. Eckhart was right. They're in here with us. There's a loose panel over there. We can use it to get across. Then do it. And fast. Yeah, that's what I had in mind, actually. When I first saw it, I thought that's what you would have to do. Down here! This is taking too long. Your men will have left before we get there. Baines and Hutchins are oh, two yeah, of my best. That they'll wait that and they'll have that shuttle ready. Lights up the place a bit more. Come on, we can't be far now. Just watch your step. The hell was that? I can't see anything. 
Well, we're going down. Yeah, I already did. Shoot. There's something coming. Move. The automatic, I feel like it's not dealing nearly as much damage as the small pistol. But I guess I, I upgraded it twice already by now. It's not super intuitive. What on earth is that smell? It's disgusting. Oh, oh, Sorry, that crap. was me. I had beans for lunch. I don't have that glow... glow worm or whatever it is. I don't know what. I can't remember what they call these. This room's right next to the maintenance bay. This is it. We made it. CEC, about us. The CEC is the largest solar mining and extraction company in the Earth colonies. It sounds like Wayland Yatani. It is also the fifth largest company in terms of market capital that has become a powerhouse of industrial might and an influential polit political force with a generous budget allocated to the election spending. CEC has always been able to maintain and improve its market position. The CEC owns over 400 deep space vehicles, including five planet crackers with the famous USG Shimura as its flagship. The CEC was the first to develop deep space mining the storage catchers. Yeah, this is a, the, the video that I was watching the other day on YouTube. It was about asteroid catchers. This is not sci-fi. We're actually truly considering doing it for real catching asteroids to mine metals out of them instead of doing it out, out of the earth because we expect the yield in pure metals out of asteroids to be so much higher than on earth that this would offset the cost of actually setting up an operation for catching an asteroid and bringing it back to closer to earth on, on, on orbit around earth to, to, to be able to mine it. it was the first to implement shock point drives for commercial use we are the largest supplier of precious metals
the shuttle. Thank God. We're safe. Not so fast. Stay back. We're not out of this yet. Mm. It's crawling with those fuckers. There's your men. Baines, this is Weller. We're right behind you. I see you, Sarge. <laughs> Hit a spot above her when we got here. Don't start laughing. This is a sign that you're about to die. We can't get inside. You crack a joke, My and then that's when you die. We'll open it. Then let's go for it. Everybody ready to run? We'll meet you halfway. I'll take point. Eckhart, stay close. Go! We're coming! Behind those crates. The heck? I'm low on ammo for everything, basically. It's not working. They must have changed the code. Oh, shit. Stay back, I'll hack it. Hurry up, we'll cover you. Got it. already have four weapons equipped though so I don't just stand there sergeant come one. on good work soldier this is bigger than we thought relax it's dead Eckhart get up here and second me I can fly but I don't know survey craft thank you Nate without you we wouldn't have got this far don't mention it. Ah! it's dead you were saying it's not dead go get me <laughs> the ship we're in it's not gonna do us much good hold on to something Here we go. My connection was fine for uh, about an hour, and now it's starting to act up again like it did before. Oh, it's the end of the chapter. Which chapter was that, by the way? The third? Ah, yeah. Yeah, that was the third. Well, let's do at least one more. My internet connection is uh, dropping right now. Ishimura, this is the survey shuttle Vestry. Come in, Ishimura. Damn it! Forget it and hang on. We're heading into the debris field. Uh oh. Uh oh. Who cares about what he, what it McNeil, costs? Make yourself useful and man the cannon. Man the cannon. Oh, hey. Okay. Damn, 
Has this thing ever been used? I can't say I've had much call to. Stop yakking and start shooting. Oh. It's the orange ones I'm supposed to shoot? So I have no control over that. If I can't see them coming, I can't shoot them. You need glasses, partner? Get your head in the game. Real great constructive criticism also. The I feel so much better at my is. job now that you've said all these mean things. All Thank you. you were violating a direct no-fly order. Return to planet side immediately. This is Shuttle CSO-4. The colony's overrun. We can't go back. Now listen here. I am Warren Eckhart, Executive Director of Colonial Mining Operations. I repeat, clearance to land is denied. Any approach will be considered hostile. Hostile? Is he insane? Fuck that! We're coming in! Holy shit! Hold on to something. Uh oh. Main thrust is a fright. We're gonna die. Ow! We live in worse shape than this. McNeil, intercept that cannon fire. Come on, Internet. Stop acting up like that. Hey, Cut. You okay? I'm... <laughs> Oxygen depletion imminent. Abandoned ship. We've got to move. Eckhart, does this thing carry any suits? Four. For surveying. Good enough. Oh, Everybody how suits convenient. Up. There's four of us. Weller, you know the Ishimura. Is there another way on board? Yeah. Should be a maintenance airlock about 200 meters four. Like scene. Put on your suit. Why do they have to make them so damn tight? Punches. Survey team don't like their guys getting popped in zero G. Come on, internet. Everyone ready? Yeah. God, I hate spacewalks. Yeah. I hate dying more. 
Let's do this. Now entering zero gravity. Follow me. Oh, you have to time it so that you don't get hit by the debris, maybe. Ah, okay, no, you can't get rid of the debris yourself. Okay, cool. Ah, just saw something. Lexine, are you all right? Nate, what happened? There was a flash. You're all right, Blue. Come on, let's get you inside. Thank you for not leaving me. You're not like Weller. <laughs> Amen to that. Silence and only hearing the. You're alive. Yeah, we're okay. Eckhart, the, close the, the air. The lock. heartbeat sound like that. It's kind of oppressive. Oppressing. Sorry. Exiting zero gravity. Fresh rising and gravity are two separate things, but they make it seem like it's the same thing. Where are we? Crew deck. Should be a comms room around here. So let's see who's home. Stand aside, son. 
C. Executive clearance. sure they've got their reasons. Bridge, this is Sergeant Weller, security. I've just got back from the colony. Bridge, come in. Oh no. No, it's happening here too. Those things are on board. Hey, calm down. For all we know, that feed could be from the colony. You don't really believe that. Yeah, even now I still believe it. I think I hear something. Open the door. I'm not sure it's a good idea. Hey, dude! Hold your fire! Who are you? Weller. Security. What happened here? Something. Those freaks killed them all. Oh, God! Easy now. Yeah. Stick with us. We'll protect you. Sure you will. Have you seen those things? Yeah. And killed a few too. McNeil, what do you think? Bridge? Will the bridge be safe? Safer than down here. Let's go. I've never seen it so quiet. Wait, move! Get away from the door! Yeah, well it's... I froze it, but it's so far away that it's not doing me any good. It's not that much of a problem. Again, the whole ship like this. We must get off the Ishimura somehow. Hang in there, Eckhart. You too, Lex. If we're smart, we'll figure this out. Shit! Booby trap! Get back! Out of the way! Stay right there. McNeil, you can defuse that, right? Who did this? I don't get it. Security, perhaps? Trying to secure the air. Oh, There's 800 on. miners on board. Any one of them could have said this. Shut up and let the man concentrate. Oh, I got a weapon. Nate, have you ever seen anything like this? I barely recognize this deck, and I work here. Slow and quiet. Infection vectors. It's been less than an hour, but they've spread fast. Flight deck was the first to go after the shuttle crashed. Now almost entirely overrun. We've lost at least half the medical deck and about a quarter of engineering. No information yet from cargo or planet ops. 
which suggests bad news. This is not what I expected. doing in the back. Uh, I'm almost out of ammo for that weapon. Somebody please wake me up. This can't be happening. Where's security? Why isn't anyone helping? Everybody calm down. Panicking won't help. probably consider using them. Pick it up, soldier. Oh, God. I think I'm going to be sick. Keep it together, sweetheart. Hold your nose or something. Well, I already have one. Shit. This gets worse by the minute. Don't even look. Just keep going. We're not going to make it out. Oh. Neil, can you fix that elevator? We need to get off this deck. You seriously think the bridge is still safe? There's only one way to find out. Help! Help! It's the elevator. Right, go, go! This is the only way through. Get your head straight and stay focused. <laughs> Nathan, she's very pale. Can we stop for a moment? No time. Man up, sweetheart. McNeil, take point. I'll cover you. Yeah, just lift your head or something. Man, it took this place apart. Marks. Wait a minute, where are we going? We should be heading for a shuttle, not a mess hall. This is the only way through. Get your head United straight and stay focused. Ascend, part two, by Carrie Van Otkin. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, professor of anthropology, blew the whistle on what he claimed was the biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government. The discovery of an artifact, or marker, which proved... Beyond any doubt, there is alien life in the universe. The government labeled Altman a cook, a cook, 
But this flames struck chord with some, and his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest. Continued. <laughs> Well, there we go. That seems to be everything. More of them. Take cover. Something big went down here. What a mess. They're all dead. Everyone's dead. Crowd control, though. I saw one on the left, but okay. At least we're going. That was the last. Let's move. Are you sure? We thought that before. I... I don't feel anything. Everybody freeze! Drop your weapons! Hold your fire, I'm Sergeant Weller, ship security! I said drop it! On your knees! Wait! You don't understand! The heck? We're on the same side. <laughs> Damage taken, 39%. Uh, perfect reloads. What is, what is perfect reloads, actually? Stasis accuracy, 100%. Uh, weapon upgrades, weapons, text logs, audio logs. Profile has been updated successfully. Bonus comic 3. I want to have a look at those comics. Next chapter. Go back to the main menu for now. Because I'd like to leave a bit of the game for tomorrow as well. So might as well look through it. I'm not even sure if I've ever read those. Come to think of it. Yeah. 
Circus 7, Colony Security Lock. Local day, 925. This is Sergeant Abraham Newman, Planet Side Security Office. We are fucked. If you're Planet Side, you're already good as dead. Just radio up and order this place nuked. I'm serious. You're gonna die down here. The least you can do is save the rest of humanity from the same fate. No kid, no kid, no kid. Written by Anthony Johnston, issue number one. Hey, you want to catch a vid tonight? Union Plaza got a new download. Bram, I already told you I've got a ton of paperwork to... Holy shit, what is that? It's Jen Barrow's dig team, I'll feed it through. Hey, Commander, everyone, heads up. What the hell is that? But just hold on there, Commander, while I consult my book of weird shit. Everyone's a comedian. That's nothing to laugh about. Are we patched through? Barrow, this is Cortez and PSEC. Is that... Can that possibly be what I think it is? I don't know, Detective. Depends on how fucked up your thoughts are, I guess. This is bullshit. They shut down excavation prep because of some piece of rock? It ain't a piece of rock. It's a marker. Who's to say it's even alien? That's the point. It's not. The mark is a part of human evolution. What? The secret of eternal life? A new life. Beyond Ooh, death. We have a believer. Beyond bullshit. Damn it, shut up! Hey, PSEC, what the hell's going on here? Come on, marker head, take your best shot. Nobody's taking shots at anybody. Bitch, mark my face! Oh, Jesus. Unitologist, right? And proud of it. We got room in the brig for these two? What? Wait a second. Never mind. I'll check. Marla? Free you, Bram. Breaking up. Oh, great. Guess it's your lucky day, folks. So sit down, eat your lunch, and grow a brain cell between you. We'll be sitting right over there. He had a point. Yeah, and lost it the minute he threw a punch. No offense, Cortez, but your fellow believers, they're fucking nuts. I can't sleep. A lot of it going around. How long you been on Colony? Since day one, why? I've seen this before. For the past two and a half years, you guys have done all the work. Done all the excavation prep. Yeah, so? And then the Ishimura shock points in at the last minute and grabs all the glory. Enough to make anyone depressed, really. I ain't depressed. I just can't sleep. Sure, sure. Look, all I can do is prescribe you some sedative pills. That's 20 cases in three days. Have you really seen this before? <laughs> Something damn strange is going on around here. For 200 years, Unitology has sought the truth. Altman? When Michael Altman I know. spread his word, few people believed him. The government tried to discredit him, and when that didn't work, they killed him and said it was an accident. But we also know he was telling the truth. For two centuries, we and our forefathers kept the faith and our belief in his words. Now, finally, we have proof that we have been right all along. You've all seen the vidlogs by now. You all know what they found out there. Here on this very planet, we found Another marker! Yeah, I thought the marker's supposed to be black. This thing's red. Newman. I'm just saying. This guy's a, what, a priest or something? Deacon Abbott. It's glowing DTM red. Engineer first Maybe class. the other one was and dead. Yes, a dead marker. Lay preacher. Who are you? Newman, p -Sec. You can't hide the truth, Mr. Newman. That's what they tried to do when they killed Altman. But we're still here. Uh, don't be stupid. CEC doesn't give a shit about some fringe nut job. Bram, that's enough. Oh, come on, this is the last straw. You can't seriously buy this crap. Buy? Damn it, this is my faith. There is no goddamn marker. Sure, that thing out there is some weird shit. Maybe it isn't even human. But in case you hadn't noticed, we already conquered heaven. And guess what? Mm, God wasn't again. home. Your God, perhaps. Our God is very much in I'd rather switch because my connection seems to be good right now. What is, how come we get this shitty job? Gee, Jerry, I don't know. Maybe it's got something to do with destroying a door in Bay 5? Accident. Damn this it. is mostly anyway, still images, it's so... Anyway, so shitty. I kind of it's like it out here. Deal. Yeah, what a great view. Not that way, you jerk. This thing. So is this really a marker or what? Hey, I just work here. All I know is Cartusia wants a tram built between here and the colony. Assault in progress in Surgery 1, West Sector 9, Level 5. Repeat assault. Newman and Cortez responding. Oh, thank God. Hurry. He's got a line cutter. PSEC, drop the cutter. This fucking quack tried to con me. He said the pills would make me sleep, but they don't. Every night I lie there in these things, these things I think about. I don't want to, but I can't stop it. Hey, hey, listen to me. 
You're stressed out, I know, but this is not going to help you. Just give me the cutter and let's talk about this. No, you're lying! Ah! Come here, you crazy son of a bitch! Doc, you all right? Yes, I'm fine, just a little sh... Doc, what is it? Katie! Oh, fuck. Captain Matthias, sir, have you had a response yet? I just got it now, but not from the government. Our instructions are from a higher authority. The church? They tell me you're a believer. My family's been devout for three generations. Is that important? Could be. What rank? I'm vested. Good. Your instructions are simple. Do all you can to safeguard the marker until the Ishimura arrives. Everything. Understand? So it's definitely a marker. Altman be praised. How far, Abbott? It's only a dust storm, Joe. Anyway, we're almost there. I still say we should have asked. Ah, uh, nonsense. Since when did we need permission to take a drive? All right, close enough. Suit up, gentlemen. Should be east ahead. That way. If the dust ever clears. There. Holy shit. Beautiful. At last. A real marker. Abbott, what are you doing? Don't touch it. Relax, Joe. Who knows how long this thing's been here? Centuries, maybe millennia. You see? I found something this is our salvation. In, in space that was glowing like that. Always were smart, my dear. After millennia. Mom, but you're dead. Deacon, listen. You must protect it. No, no, this isn't right. Go, go away. What is he talking to? Abbott. Hey, go yeah, I really want to touch it. Don't. Are you alright? What the fuck just happened? I, not sure. I think we just saw the other side. To be continued. Hmm. You know what? Let's watch another. Uh, let's see. And I'll leave the rest for tomorrow. The rest of the the comics. I wonder if this was ever published Katie was my assistant like on for paper five or something. Years. She was devoted to a job, but that devotion got Katie killed. As you know, everyone's stressed right As now. As you know. You can't sleep, you have bad dreams when you do. Katie saved my life. If she hadn't called PSEC, I'd be lying in the morgue right now. I'd gladly make that exchange. And I... I know you would, Tom. Katie? But there are more important things you have to do, Tom. You've got to stop them. No, no, this isn't real. Tom, are you all right? Sorry, folks. Tom's not feeling Damn, too I good. Damn, I paid Thanks 47 for euros for this. Oh, Christ, she's Jeez. gone. Graham? Oh, shit. What time is it? 9.50. Shift started 80 minutes ago. Third day in a row, Vera. I can't keep covering like this. I mean, we're all exhausted I right now. I can't sleep, Bram. The doc gave me some pills, but they don't always work. Uh, you realize you sound like every other miner we've arrested this past week? I know, damn it! You hallucinating too? You're getting visions of your precious marker? All right, that's enough. Get out! Vera, come on. We've got a shift to work. So go work it. This is outrageous. That site is of major archaeological importance. It's a sacred object, not some rock to be mined. A marker. You know what that means. That's still to be determined. By the proper authorities, not some transport engineer. Touch that artifact again, and you'll be on a shuttle back to Earth before you could say Altman be praised. I don't believe this. You're devout. You of all people shouldn't try to stop us practicing our faith. You blustering idiot. I'm not telling you to stop believing. I'm telling you to stay away from that marker. Goodbye, Abbott. I wonder if that guy doctor, knew what it was, you, what it, what it would do. Come in, Doctor. What can I do for you? Sir, we need to make this problem, the depressions, insomnia, all of it, our top priority. Not just medically. I doubt handing out sleeping pills is going to solve this. I think there's a deeper root to this problem. Don't we have a clinical psychiatrist? Dr. Welland, yes, but that's not what I'm talking about. Then I don't follow you. This all started after we found that artifact. And I don't believe in coincidences. 
I want to examine it thoroughly. Maybe it's radioactive in some way. Or... Out of the question. Come on, Doctor. This is all just down to stir-crazy miners who've been cooped up with bad recycled air for too long. Sir, with respect, I've never seen anything like this before. If I could just examine... I said no. Now please, see yourself out. By the way, your nurse, what did you do with the... with her body? She's in the morgue, of course. The Ishimura will take her back home when it leaves, why? Goodbye, Doctor. The... You mind explaining to might me why the fuck we're standing out here instead of peace out? How these creatures came to be on the ship as well? The first real marker we found in 200 years and we get to safeguard it. Sorry, Abbott, but you've all got to stay behind the cordon. Natalia, I've got a dozen people here, all wanting My to see it, to experience it. And they can, from behind the cordon. But you don't know what you're denying us. Have you seen them yet? Seen what? The symbols? You can't miss them. The visions. When I came down here a couple of days ago, I saw something incredible. This is the real deal. Come on, let us through. No one gets through the cordon, especially not you. Carthusia singled you out. Maybe he's right, Jerry. What harm can they do? No. Then we'll stay here, and we'll pray, and we'll wait. Thanks for helping me out, Sergeant. No problem. I'm with you. There's some weird shit going on with that rock. You have no idea how glad I am to hear someone not call it the marker. That's bullshit. Trust me, I know a thing or two about unitology. Your partner? Where is she anyway? She's got whatever head fuck is freaking out the rest of the colony. But yeah, it kind of fell out. Because she's a unitologist? No, because she's an idiot. <laughs> this guy is her boyfriend. <laughs> there you go. Holy shit. Now I see it with my own eyes. What's going on here? I heard about this. Pilgrim's coming out to worship. Sorry, guys. This is as close as you get. You want to join the prayers? Abbott's leading a group over there. Can't say I'm surprised. Cortez? You're supposed to be laid up sick. Abbott said I should come here instead, and I feel better already. This is crazy. What the fuck happened? Honestly, then? I feel sorry for you. You don't understand what you're missing. I know exactly what this bullshit is about. I lost my wife to your fucked hey. up cult, remember? Hey! Is there a problem here? No. Uh, uh, what did I do? I backed out of it. Ah, well, we were probably almost at the end anyway. There's no way to skip through it, is it? Is there? To get back to the part where I was. No, you press a single button and you're uh, kicked back out. This is uh, outrageous. You can't fl flip the pages if this is supposed to be a comic. You press C, you, you're kicked back out. You press Z, you're kicked back out. Yeah, no, no. Okay, well, never mind then. Well, I'll I'll keep looking through these tomorrow as as I am progressing through the game. It's actually a good way to rest your eyes because the game can be, get pretty tiring on your eyes actually with the camera panning and shaking all the time. It's kind of hard to keep your attention focused on these things. But anyway, I'll be back tomorrow in the afternoon and hopefully my internet connection doesn't act up too much tomorrow night. Actually, it's just as well that I stop now considering that it that doesn't seem to want to stabilize itself. It was perfect for a while and then it started to act up again but anyway I had in mind any way to play the whole rest of the of the game tomorrow in the afternoon because it's not a very long one and that way on Sunday afternoon I can stream Resident Evil 1 both scenarios with both character playthroughs back to back and hopefully my internet is stable at that time too but anyway, take care of yourselves, guys. Have a good rest of the night. And I'll see you tomorrow in the afternoon if you guys can make it. Bye-bye and take care until then.